Here's a good example of why you shouldn't take anything for granted if you don't have solid data to back it up. By now we all know of the vulnerability when grabbing the ledge in Smash 4, and after almost a year people everywhere still say that the duration of the vulnerability is one frame. However, it's not one frame, it's two frames, and I'll prove it to you now. So here's me doing Zero Suit's flip kick on Sheik's ledge snap. These are the frames when Sheik is invincible before she snaps onto the ledge, and here she grabs the ledge and gets hit by the flip kick on the first frame of her ledge snap vulnerability. This is normal and how we thought it always goes. However, here I do it again, now attempting to hit Sheik slightly later. Upon slowing this down, we see the frames before she snaps onto the ledge again. But this time when she reappears to grab the ledge, we don't hit her like we did the last time because we delayed it. Now if the vulnerability was only one frame like everyone says it is, we would have missed our shot at this point. As you can see though, Sheik does get hit on the next frame, more specifically frame 2 of her ledge snap, proving that the vulnerability lasts for two frames instead of one. Here we do it again but with different characters and a different stage. Here Mewtwo is invincible before grabbing the ledge, and when he reappears to grab the ledge, Falcon's down air hits him on frame 1 of his ledge snap. And this is the same thing but with down air delayed. Mewtwo is invincible before snapping onto the ledge, he reappears to grab onto it and whereas he got hit on this frame previously, now he gets hit on the next frame aka frame 2 of his ledge snap. As a finishing point, if you connect with your attack on frame 3 or any later on the opponent's ledge snap, nothing happens, proving that the vulnerability isn't anything more than 2 frames. Of course there is a chance that some characters have different ledge snap vulnerabilities, but no one I've tested so far has less or more than 2. Also, keep in mind that the ledge snap is fully invincible if you grab the ledge from even slightly above stage level. It's been almost a year people, so hopefully now we can start calling this by its correct term. Anyway, thanks for watching and later.